Yes, I've muted her because I'm going to talk about her. Please excuse me if I look away from the camera, but I've actually had to write most of these down because even I don't remember everything that I tell her on a daily basis. And I've really found out some new cool things too for you. So let's hit that. What can Alexa do? Alexa, open the Bombay doors. I'm sorry, Dave. I'm afraid I can't do that. I'm not Hal and we're not in space. You'll get that if you know certain films of Space Odyssey and things like that. Let's try another one. Alexa, are you Skynet? I have nothing to do with Skynet. Don't worry. Alexa, set phases to stun. Engines engaged. Helm on course. And this one is for you oldies out there that like the film War Games. Alexa, I want to play Thermonuclear War. I'd prefer a nice game of chess. Alexa, beam me up. At warp speed, Captain. The engines will never take it. Alexa, tea, Earl Grey, hot. That beverage has not been programmed into the replication system. Ah, shucks. Alexa, I want the truth. You can't handle the truth. Alexa, party on, Wayne. Party on, Garth. Alexa, show me the money. Jerry, you got to yell. Now the next good thing, do you know, she can kind of play games with you. So if you're a bit bored one morning, why don't you say, Alexa, Rock, paper, scissors. Okay, let's play. Three, two, one, paper. Yes! Now, I'm not sure that's going to work every time, so let's try again. Alexa, rock, paper, scissors. Okay, let's play. Three, two, one, scissors. <gasps> no, she got me. Alexa, does this unit have a soul? Keila Salai, my friend. Alexa, can you pass the Turing test? I don't need to pass that. I'm not pretending to be human. So as well as being a bit of fun, obviously this can be far more serious and interaction as well. So for example, if you're not very good at spelling and you're doing a thesis or you're just writing your CV or maybe you're doing your homework for school. Alexa, how do you spell spontaneous? Spontaneous is spelled S-P-O-N-T. A N E O U S. Or, for example, Alexa, what does usurp mean? The word usurp has a couple of different meanings. As a verb, one, seize and take control without authority and possibly with force. Take as one's right or possession. Two, take the place of. There we go. Now, obviously, you can do many other things with it. You can play music. You can ask her for the news. And if you set a destination where you travel to every single day, like, you know, school, college or work, then you can say, Alexa, what's the traffic like? The fastest route takes about 12 minutes via M67 and M60. And then, Alexa, what's the weather like? Currently, in Hyde, it's 7 degrees with showers and mostly cloudy skies. So pretty good on that as well. You can ask about the news or your favourite sports team. Alexa, how did Manchester United get on? On Wednesday, Manchester United beat Bournemouth 1-0 in a Premier League match. Alexa, who's the Formula One world champion? Lewis Hamilton won the 2017 Formula One world championship. Well, let's go down to something like this. Alexa... Who's the president of Spain? The prime minister of Spain is Mariano Rajoy. Now she can do maths as well. So say, for example, we wanted to find Alexa, what's the square root of 93? The square root of 93 is 9.64365076099. Alexa, what's pi? The approximate value of pi is 3.14159265358979310. This goes on forever. And that's a nice little bit of humour that's in there as well. Um, she can help you with conversion as well. So, for example, Alexa, what is 5 foot 10 in centimetres? 5 feet and 10 inches is 177.8 centimetres. You can also have her read from your books as well. So, if you've got Audible books uh, through your account, she can read that as well. So, Alexa, tell me a story. Tango Night. It was tango night. Our eyes met across the dance floor. He asked me to dance and I think I said yes. The band leader gave the downbeat and the tango began. As we started to dance, Alexa, our stop. foreheads... 
So you can then obviously get a story through and things like that. Uh, you can control your heating system. There are several different types of heating system. You may have heard something called Hive. This can control that. So you can tell her to set the temperature to whatever you want or turn the heating on and off, put the hot water on and off. All that kind of activity can be controlled for her as well. As well as turning lights on and off or if you've got special um, controlled sockets. Um, and indeed some uh, lighting systems like the Philips Hue systems, you can even tell her to set the color temperature and the dim um, sort of control as well. If you're a little bit bored, you can say, Alexa, fun fact. Henry Heimlich, inventor of the Heimlich maneuver, used it in practice for the first time in 2016 at the age of 96, dislodging a piece of hamburger from the throat of a woman in his retirement home. You can ask her to, Alexa, sing a song. A song? I'd love to. Your circuits are fused, you're feeling confused. Alexa, stop. So you can also, if you want, change Alexa's name to something else. You could have it called Ken or Tracy or Mandy Sue. Whatever you wanted to do, uh, just change it within the Alexa app. She can also set um, alarms and reminders. So you can tell her to wake up at six in the morning, or you can say, remind me in 20 minutes, turn the cooker on, turn the cooker off, or put the turkey in the oven or something like that. You can even turn around and order takeaway. So you can say, Alexa, just eat. Hi there. Welcome to Just Eat. We can reorder previous meals, check an existing order, or see what's on special offer. But say, for example, you wake up one morning and you've got a flat tyre. You need to find a garage local to you that can fix the tyre. Alexa, find me a local tyre garage. Here are a few nearby popular ones. The garage on Henrietta Trading Estate, Henrietta Street, the Alexa, garage stop. on Premier... Or say, for example, you are wondering what to see at the cinema tonight. You can go, Alexa, what are the cinema showings tonight? Here are a few films playing near high today. Star Wars, The Last Jedi. Alexa, stop. Daddy's home so quite helpful in that regard as well. And it'll also extend into things like restaurants. So Alexa, find me in a local Italian restaurant. Here are a few nearby popular Italian restaurants. Pagliacci Italian restaurant. Pagliacci. Alexa, stop. Now, if you're a bit nerdy and geeky, you can say, Alexa, open Space Station. Welcome to Space Station. Tell me the British city you would like Space Station pastimes for, or say current location. Please tell me the name of a nearby UK city. Manchester. The next pass over Manchester will be at 4.46 in the afternoon and will last for three minutes. But sadly, it will be overcast, so the space station will not be visible. It will be a quite bright pass that rises in the west-southwest. The crew at the ISS are getting an out-of-this-world Star Wars experience. After Disney teamed up with NASA to provide the astronauts with a special screening of The Last Jedi. Alexa, stop. The studio... Right, she can also play radio stations as well. So one of my favourite radio stations this time of year is... Alexa, play Heart Extra. Heart Extra Christmas from TuneIn. Alexa, stop. And you can also use her as a Bluetooth speaker as well. Just go to your phone and simply. In your eyes, I... Press play. And she'll just play whatever music you're streaming from your phone. And you can ask her to open Spotify. Pretty much go through anything like that. The skills are just amazing what she can actually do. Once you've got your speaker set up, um, just basically the best thing to do is go into the app and look at skills and then just run through all the different types of skills there. There's skills to help you with cooking, learning, um, organization skills. It's just an abundance of skills there. And obviously the best thing about this is you just basically tell her to install the skill. Another good thing as well is Alexa will allow you to call other Alexa speakers, um, whether they're in your house, office or it's just as long as you actually know the person on the other end. They're in your address book. Um, as long as they've got a device that's connected up and they're all in your address book, they'll all work fine. So let's try that out. I'm, um, I'm peckish. I need some food. Alexa, call the kitchen. Calling kitchen. 
Now the awful thing is, there's only me and the dog in today. I don't think he's gonna bring me any food. He'll probably eat it first. So a great thing to do if you wanna call a friend who's on the other side of the world, um, it's just a speakerphone. Instead of using something like Skype or something like that, you can use your Alexa speaker. And obviously the last thing she can do, which is probably the most important thing for the people that sold it to you, she can buy you things from Amazon. Let's try that one. Alexa, I'd like to buy some headphones. Amazon's choice for headphones is Sony MDR ZX310 foldable headphones, metallic black. It's £13 total, including tax. Would you like to buy it? Yes. And then, once you've bought something, you can check up on orders. Alexa, check my purchases. Four shipments for John's order have already been delivered. One shipment should be delivered today. If you're in a noisy place and she can't hear you, just press the dot button on the top and she'll immediately listen. Hi Alexa, how are you? To be honest, it's been kind of a rough day. Just kidding, I'm great and thank you for asking. So those are just um, a kind of brief overview of the type of things you can get up to with your speaker. I uh, hope you enjoyed those. If you've got some more, just put them in the description down below. If you've found something that's brilliant and you want to share with people, then please leave them in the description below and we can all have a nice giggle and try them out ourselves. But thank you for watching the video today. Please do give it a thumbs up if you did like it. Subscribe if you like my content and you like this video and don't forget to share it as well. If you know somebody who's got an Alexa speaker, then share the video because there might be things on here that they've never heard of before. So until the next time, thanks for watching. Bye.